the pair, who met on the set of Game of Thrones are marrying at Rose's childhood home in Aberdeenshire, Scotland And Rose's father was spotted outside the entrance to the estate and happily told reporters he was thrilled his daughter would win today On Friday an enormous white marquee was spotted, being erected in the grounds of Ward Hill Castle, where guests will be in joy after wedding breakfast and speeches It's anticipated Rose and Kit will say their vows in front of 80 close friends and family in the plush drawing room Today Rose's close-knit family were seen clearing leaves from the driveway in preparation for the day Speaking outside the castle dad Sebastian Leslie said, we are absolutely thrilled for Kit and Rose to be marrying today It's an absolutely lovely day for us. Adding, it's a great day for Aberdeenshire We are using local caterers, local lighting, local flowers. Rose and Kit, both 31, will spend their wedding night in the Laird Suite which features a sizable four-poster bed The 12th century castle is advertised as one of the most unique buildings in Aberdeenshire and has been in Rose's family for 900 years Lucky guests will enjoy some truly breathtaking scenery from the remote spot which stands on top of Benachie Hill Ward Hill Castle is home to the ancient Leslie clan, of which redeemed beauty Rose belongs with her father, the Honorable Alexander Leslie, is the clan chief And naturally, after the couple met on the set of Game of Thrones, their guest list is packed to the brim with famous names Company stars Emilia Clarke, Sophie Turner and Peter Dinklage have all been spotted touching down at Aberdeen Airport on Friday afternoon, and it's expected many more will follow Kit Harrington admits he blew his load early when proposing to fellow Game of Thrones actor Rose Leslie but sadly, Kit is ruled out that his big day will have a special Game of Thrones theme Instead guests can look forward to some entertainment by chart-topping folk band Mumford & Sons Kit grew close to the boys after meeting them on The Graham Norton Show in 2015 Inside Kit Harrington's luxury stag do at private country retreat as he prepares to marry Game of Thrones co-star Rose Leslie during an appearance on The Jonathan Rawl Show two years later, Kit told how he'd contacted the Game of Thrones producer to find out his filming schedule in case they needed to change the date of his nuptials which clashed with the final season He said, I rang him up and I said, I'm getting married and it's all your fault actually, I think for the final season he is so stressed that he's reached that peaceful level I was like, you need to factor in a Game of Thrones wedding by the way They the cast have all got to be there, so the whole thing has got to shut down Kit Harrington reveals he cried when he read the final Game of Thrones script and says I know everything now 